I think that's our work at this time, is to expand our awareness and to increase tolerance. Uh, and um, I think uh, uh, one of the things that um, is palatable for everyone is that we often carry fear about that which is different. And one way of collapsing fear is knowability. And in order to uh, begin to make connection, there has to be a curiosity. And I think that uh, one of the, the greatest uh, works of our time uh, for all of us is how can we um, uh, begin to de uh, develop our curiosity so it's greater than our criticality or our fear. And that once we can sustain curiosity, we become active learners and we begin to appreciate. But the, the one force, you know, human beings as a species are here for really two purposes. One is to learn about love and to express love or affection. And the other is to create and to make a contribution. And I think that in the realm of curiosity, uh, curiosity always holds our attention and always uh, brings in a spaciousness of allowance. Uh, it's a, a focus uh, that's open-ended, that um, uh, has no judgment, the space of not making a premature assessment. Uh, but to move into the spirit of exploration. I think uh, we need to become childlike again uh, to return to wonder and awe and curiosity because children are, are not of, afraid of anything. Uh, they're always exploring. Uh, they don't say, oh, this is good to explore or this is bad to explore. They say, oh, I want to know what that is or uh, and I think we need to return to that childlike uh, curiosity, not childish, but childlike curiosity of state of wonder, a state of awe, state of discovery, a state of exploration, a beginner's mind uh, uh, with each other. Uh, and I think it's so interesting uh, that uh, the very positive thing of, of uh, the internet is that we're able to make uh, international friends who we've never made, met, but we cluster in interests. Interests bring us together, and that's the first doorway, uh, you know. And so it's very interesting that uh, business people or people in business uh, were the real pioneers to international work uh, and connecting to that. Uh, which is unfamiliar, different modes of doing business and, and different rituals of connection cross-culturally. But it's also interesting to me that uh, every culture uh, of the world has uh, 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 gift-giving, generosity, which is a sign of respect, and there are rituals about meeting in which we extend respect to each other and respect from the truest sense of the willingness to look again. It comes from respect our, the willingness to look again. Can we look again? Maybe how I see this is not true. Maybe how I see this is only partially true. But can I hold the curiosity to discover and uncover that uh, which uh, I, I'm exploring? I'm exploring, can we hold the true explorer's mind and be open to uh, explorations that we haven't considered? <music>